The Guided by Prayer.com daily devotional for today comes from 2 Timothy 2 verses 4-5. It reads, No one serving as a soldier gets entangled in civilian affairs, but rather tries to please his commanding officer. Similarly, anyone who competes as an athlete does not receive the victor's crown except by competing according to the rules. What distracts you? Is it your need to have a clean house and food on the table similar to Martha in the story of Mary and Martha as she was preparing for Jesus and the disciples? Are you distracted by money like the tax collector Zacchaeus? Or in today's world do you find yourself distracted by social media, noticing that your screen time each week is creeping up in small increments? Whatever it may be, every Christian has, is, or will face distractions of many kinds. The most dangerous distraction Christians will face is any distraction away from God. The natural tendency for human beings is to shift our attention from object to object, depending on what holds highest importance leaves us vulnerable to keeping our priority firmly set on Christ. Our distractions can therefore be a form of idolatry, as our distractions will reveal what is most important to us. The verse above highlights the importance of not getting distracted by civilian affairs, but instead giving full attention to the commanding officer, God. So how do we as Christians counter our distractions and turn our attention to God? Take note of the things, people, and matters that tend to distract you, that draw your attention away from God. These things reveal the nature of the heart and what you love. It takes self-control and discipline to learn to overcome your distractions and center your heart and mind on God. Closing with our prayer. Lord, whatever it takes, help me to learn to counter my distractions with a stronger focus on you and matters that are important to you. Deliver me from the distractions that take my mind off of you. In Jesus' name. Amen. This has been another daily devotional from guidedbyprayer.com. Thank you for listening. Have a blessed day. You can find a link to today's devotional in the description below. You will also be able to sign up for email notifications by clicking the link.